The United Nations celebrates and commemorates countless international days of recognition. World AIDS Day, World Children's Day, World Tuna Day, International Women's Day, World Steel Pan Day, the list is endless. However, a commemoration that is integral to Caribbean existence and global island prosperity is World Oceans Day. If you have ever lived on an island, the ocean must have been a part of your life. And that's even if you're not one for a sea bath, shrimp or snapper, salted only by the sea water. Derek Walcott, that Nobel laureate, famous island poet from St. Lucia wrote, the sea is history. It is tribal memory, a gray vault of all sorts of memories. But enough of the poetry. The increasingly popular description of islands is now large ocean states rather than small island developing states in recognition of the fact that SIDS are custodians of about one-fifth of all global ocean space. However, we are constantly pushing Caribbean marine life to new extremes. We are in serious danger of breaching the carrying capacity of these delicate ecosystems. The ever-warming waters, invasive species like lionfish, the never-ending sagas and blooms, overfishing, pollution, and habitat degradation are changing our waters so drastically that in two generations, our grandees will not recognize the Caribbean Sea that we knew. Eclat Caribbean is committed to efforts to preserve and protect the Caribbean Sea and to supporting activities to rehabilitate her to a more robust condition. Yes. We have joined the Generation Restoration. We're also committed to helping our governments and people maximize the potential of their blue economies and in this our largest and potentially most dynamic shared resource. For example, we're working on feasibility study to make Antigua's English Harbor a growth pole for sustainable tourism development and diversification, providing a roadmap for job creation in the community to diversify the tourism product and to attract additional yachting and marine traffic. Eclat Caribbean is deeply committed to supporting and connecting regional governments to protect and promote a truly sustainable ocean economy and ecosystem. So whether you dip in the salt, roast a fish, or sit on the sand and marvel at the beauty of our Caribbean Sea. Happy World Oceans Day.